Welcome to JSA TV and JSA Podcast, where we're covering the latest stories, trends, and innovations in the digital infrastructure industry. I'm Allison Whelan, and joining me today is Karen Petersburg, the newest leadership addition to the Powerhouse Data Center's team. Karen, thank you so much for joining us here. Thank you for letting me be here. I appreciate it. Of course. It. Well, first of all, congratulations on your appointment as Vice President of Data Center Development and Construction. Thank you. Can you tell you. us a little bit more about your new role and yes. what inspired you to join Powerhouse? Sure, I'd love to. You know, um, the new role really gets to encompass the whole broad range of the data center from site acquisition all the way through the construction. And I've got extensive experience in the construction and um, the commissioning and the design of the data center. So I'm really excited to get kind of the, the bigger picture view as well as support um, Powerhouse's efforts as they move into or as we move into the data center industry in a big way. So I'm super excited to be a part of what's launching and is going to be, you know, on the cutting edge of where the future needs to be to support the industry that I so love. Absolutely. And there's always so many amazing announcements coming out of Powerhouse. So you've landed at a great place. Congratulations Thank again. You. And then last night, you're very, you guys are very involved in the event here at DCD Connect Virginia. So last night, you guys hosted a women in tech event. Yes. You want to tell us a little bit about that? Sure. It was wonderful. We had about 30 to 40 women um, leaders in the industry up and down the data center ecosystem. And we had Doug, our CEO. He was our sommelier. Is that the right way? Sommelier. <laughs> yes, I cannot speak. Um, but yeah, he was our sommelier, and he was explaining the wines. And then we had a lot of our leadership, managing leadership, the men pouring the wines for the women, and oh, it was love amazing that. food. <laughs> and it was just great way for, for us to network, the women to network together, and just support each other because it's. It's, as most people know, you know, there's not a lot of women in the industry. And so having these opportunities for us to get to know each other a little bit better is, is just really important. And the fact that American Real Estate Partners and Powerhouse Data Center supports that is just another wonderful reason of why I work here. It's just amazing to see how much that they care about women and diversity in the industry and just in general. It's just fantastic. Well, it's so, so important. And we also got to sit next to each other yesterday at the I Am Women's Lunch. So just another women in tech event. So we're covering the full circuit here. Yes, um, but in just a little bit, you're speaking on a supply chain issue focused panel. Yes. Can you give our viewers a preview of that? Sure, sure. Yeah, so we're going to speak about a lot of different things. I mean, supply chain covers a broad range of subjects from people, right? Because there's a workforce scarcity issue that we have. So that's a, a huge problem we need to overcome. Uh, there's obviously material goods that have issues um, in the supply chain. Uptime Institute put out a survey, 25% did not actually ever see a supply chain challenge. I think it was in 2022, maybe, or 2023. Um, but I do believe that there are significant issues and it's going to take the industry as a whole together to work through a lot of this stuff. And, and it's not just supply chain challenges. There's also infrastructure issues. You know, the amount of data that's coming now onto the infrastructure that we have currently, it's not sized appropriately. So if you think about the cars that are on the road, it's like a traffic jam, right? So they need to build bigger roads. And then, of course, you have AI on top of that. So it's not just the amount of cars, it's how fast they're going and, right. and how much power they need to move. And so it's like a whole conglomeration of issues that are just bubbling up all at the same time. And so it's going to be really fun to see how our industry faces those challenges and really overcomes them because it's going to take some out of the box thinking. And so this panel is going to be talking about ways we can kind of broach these subjects and see how we can make these waves change and really hopefully uh, come together and have some good brain power on what it could take to possibly solve some of these of course. awful and it's, challenges. It's so interesting because I think when you hear supply chain, your mind can automatically go to materials. Yes. But the fact that you said people too, that is so critical, especially in our industry. So 100%. it's going to be an amazing panel. Oh, Looking so. forward to popping in for that. Good. And if you're here at DCD Connect Virginia, be sure to stop by Karen's panel. Yep. Check it out. Learn a little bit more about supply chain in the industry. Mm -hmm. And thank you so much for joining us. <laughs> thank you for having me. with you. <laughs> yeah. To spend the last two days with you. I know, um, it's awesome. And thank you to our viewers for tuning in. Happy networking. Mm -hmm.